today we're talking about backflow. Put simply, backflow is water being sucked or pushed in the wrong direction within a plumbing system. The key issue is that when backflow occurs, it can draw contaminants into the plumbing system, making the water supply unsafe, especially if the water is used for drinking, washing or food preparation. This can pose a risk to health and must be prevented. After all, no one would want to drink water from baths, showers, the heating system or the toilet. Contaminated water may have an abnormal smell, taste or colour. The temperature could be higher or there could be the presence of particles. If you are concerned about the smell, taste or appearance of your water, you should always contact your local water supplier for advice. Contaminated water may not always appear or smell different, so the warning signs may not be present or visible. For contamination from backflow to occur, three things are needed. Water, a contaminant and a change in pressure. For example, a burst in the road or simply someone turning on a tap in a plumbing system can cause a change in pressure, which increases the risk of backflow. Here are a few examples of situations where backflow has been identified in homes. With a hand basin for example, if there is not a big enough air gap between the tap and the rim of the basin, there could be a risk of backflow, especially when the basin is full. If there is a change in pressure in the plumbing system, water can be sucked back from the basin and delivered to a tap somewhere else in the home. A hose left in something like a bucket might not seem like a problem, but it is a common cause of backflow. A hose could also be left when filling a garden pond or paddling pool. Rather than filling by hand, some people leave the hose to become submerged while getting on with other things. However, this poses a real risk to friends, family and neighbours. As water can be sucked back from the pond, into your drinking water or your neighbours. You can protect against backflow with tap gaps, air gaps or mechanical devices. The backflow protection needed depends on the level of risk. If you have any concerns, please speak to your local water company. To find out more about backflow or about the water fittings regulations or water bylaws in Scotland, you can contact your local water company 